Hello, hello, hello. Welcome to episode number three of the Proto Mine SMP server. Right today, boom, we are going to be trying to build out a couple more of these houses and potentially do a little bit of terraforming and stuff like that. So I have some shulker boxes here of building materials, which I just realized I capitalized one M and not the other. Fabulous. Anywho, we I've got we've got some stuff. So we've got some a lot of stone brick, some quite a few wood stuff, uh, more stone brick and some re red nether brick. And then I've tried to gather up a lot of bone blocks, but I feel like I'm only going to mainly be doing like the first floor, as it were, of the houses. Like these two houses we've built on stream. So if you're not watching my streams, it's twitch.tv slash do Link is in the description as always uh, but yeah none of these houses are furnished yet because i'm just basically I, yeah i'm just planning out the houses where they're going to go just so i can try and figure out what business is going to go where so where i'm going to put like the blacksmith and all that kind of stuff because i might just do like a little blacksmith kind of thing here or whatever who knows because it's not good some of the building because obviously it's a city you're not really going to have like a big open forge it's just going to be like a house with a little fire pit kind of thing on the outside that's pretty much what a lot of the uh or when you see in like films and video games and stuff like that a lot of the city based uh like blacksmiths and things are like just basically inside of a house so i'm gonna go into the first time lapse straight away and uh we are gonna go straight into building out some of these houses so without further ado let's get into building mode Let's a uh, rock and a roll. Let's go. We are back and uh my excuse the little chest monster that's going on here. But we've uh, we've outlined a couple of the buildings, so let's go up to a higher point to have a look. Ooh, boop. Okay, so now we have outlined a whole bunch more buildings. So uh I'm thinking I'm just thinking here, so I might make this one kind of like the enchanting kind of area. Probably that one there. And I'm thinking like one of these bigger buildings, like over this side. So maybe like this one might be like the library for me to basically continue. I'm going to need a lot of wood. And I'm going to have to turn it into the um, spruce log block. So yay for the bad exchange rates of four logs to three blocks. Great exchange rate. But I'm, yeah, I'm going to have to do that because obviously some of these diagonals, I don't really want to have a whole bunch of logs looking like that on every single bit. And it, it'll just look a bit messy. So I'm going to have to go out and gather more, even though, yes, I do have two shulker boxes and a double chest nearly completely full of spruce logs. I don't think it's going to be enough to complete it, especially if I'm doing this kind of pattern. So uh, I will 
go on a massive uh, resource mining spree and see if we can get some more to try and get some of these buildings more complete. So I'll catch you guys once I have gathered all the resources, which will probably be done on a stream. So I will catch you guys on the stream at twitch.tv slash to last do. Link is in the description. I'll catch you guys in a sec when I've gathered all the resources. All right, guys, we are back. And after we get, we gathered shulker box and a little bit of bone blocks. This is already, this shulker box already here. So it's just an overflow, but I put all the bone blocks that I own into there. So we've got no other bone blocks. It's all in this shulker box. And then there's a little bit extra over here. So I'm going to see how much this can do in terms of building. Uh, I'll probably get maybe three more houses, possibly a fourth, but I highly doubt it. But I'll give it a good shot and see how much we can get done. Uh, we'll just spam the bed because I do not want mobs spawning here because I do have not lit up this area at all. No lighting whatsoever except from what's on the houses because that's pretty much all that's going to be lighting this area up is the houses i'll probably have like a little bit of like hidden lighting and things like that all dotted around the place but let's jump into yet another time lapse and uh we're gonna see how much we can get built <laughs> have uh, started to build up let's go for a little fly up here just so you can see what we've done so as you can see we've done one two three four five six seven more houses uh, I am trying to get more well, I could just smelt down a whole bunch of netherrack but I have been afking uh, when I've not been obviously building and recording I have been afking at my gold farm to try and get some gold to give to the bar to the um, piglins so that way I can basically just get some free nether brick without having to actually smelt and use up coal and whatever. But we are slowly running out because this chest used to be full. So I am slowly running out of nether brick to turn into red nether brick. It's annoying that I can't just put like the red nether wart with red nether wart. The nether warp with uh, normal nether brick when it's in its actual brick form that you can place. So we we have got some. So I've, I've got materials here to actually pretty much like finish this base off. But at the minute, that's going to be for another episode to finish it off. Because I started it on a stream, just building this off and making sure it was as mob proof as possible. <laughs> So pretty much all of the floor is made out of half slabs and any full blocks are, I have put on carpet because I thought mobs couldn't spawn on top of string but they can. I didn't realise they could so that was a surprise to me. The only thing I need to do is put a carpet on top of the observer or, or like half slabs on top of both those observers and on top of that block there as well. Because 
piglins can still spawn on there. So I need to do that. I, I do have enough resources just to like grind out and get all the houses done. But that just putting together those houses was just over three hours worth of work. So I will put in little bits of time here and there, like a couple of hours here, a couple of hours there, just to get more of this city up and running. Because it'll be cool to have it complete. Why am I going over here? There's another water over there. Um, I'm just not thinking. My nether wart farm's over here. But, yeah, it would be nice to get the, uh, city much closer to completion. Because that would be cool once it is complete. Because then I'll be able to decide what, uh, like, what profession goes where. And what the city kind of does. But that's kind of what I'm doing on the season. On this season. I'm trying to push myself to build things that I don't normally build to get a different uh, perspective on things there we go perfect right let's turn all of that into a red and nether brick however much I got that is all of it okay that's not too bad not too bad just over three stacks okay so that's three more stacks of red and nether brick I do have a couple of stacks already uh, let's just check in the chests over here uh here it is so that is all of it that i have oh, i've got some more in here as well okay so we do have a fair amount of red nether bricks so i could get some of the roofs done but i think i will save that for another time i might i think i'm going to start trying to come up with a path idea so i can start putting in paths and decorating a little bit more on the outside before I start, because I haven't done any interiors on any of the buildings. But that's pretty much what we have today planned. I just pretty much had that build planned. So I will uh, come up with some ideas for paths. And then in the next episode, I think we're going to try and work on in here a little bit. Because I want to get something in here. Like I want to get like my idea that I was talking with some of the guys out, uh, the other day is this little alcove here. I think we're going to try and turn into a little garden and have the bee farm. It will obviously be bricked off and whatever, like separated off like a proper room. And I have a pet skeleton now. But yeah, I think we're going to turn this little alcove into a bee farm. So it's going to be properly cordoned off and it's going to be with like proper doors to get in so that way the bees can't get out. And uh, yeah, I might just let my chicken roam around in the bee farm area as well you never know probably will and then just have like a minecart going around underneath like whizzing around but yeah that's it for this episode i think guys so thank you so much for watching if you're new to the channel please 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 don't forget to subscribe it really does help me out i am getting closer to 50 subscribers which is nice very nice but uh also, if you want to come watch me live over on Twitch, that link is in the description down below. And uh, come join my Discord where we can chill, talk, maybe play a couple of games of anything else you want. That's all. The link for that is also in the, found in the description down below. So guys, thank you so much for watching. I'll see all of you in the next video. Until then, have a fabulous rest of your evening, or morning, or afternoon, depending on when you're watching this. Until then, have a great day. Peace out.